Evan, I believe you predicted here that the Democrats would demagogue the Medicare issue. Did you not? Demagoguing works. That's that, the headline here is demagoguing works. It's really a serious thing. It may just be New York 26, but it's a huge, I mean, to be apocalyptic about this, if the democratic system cannot figure out what to do about this problem, it's big trouble for the whole country for a very long time. Charles, what's the lesson from this election? Evans' wisdom. Demagoguery works, especially on Medicare. And for Republicans, the message is this. Uh, you are linked to this Medicare proposal. There's no escaping it. All but the four uh, Republican House members supported it, all but the five in the Senate. You can't run away. Either you know how to defend it and you do it or you're dead. Okay, as Charles said, less than 24 hours after a Democrat won that election, Senate Democrats forced a symbolic roll call vote. The Medicare plan that had passed the House, uh, it failed in the Senate, five Republicans joining the uh, Democratic majority. And when uh, pa Bill, Paul Ryan and Bill Clinton bumped into each other at the Reagan building, listen to what the former president said. Hey, Paul hey, Ryan. How are you? Yeah. I told, before you got here, probably, I said, I, I, I said, I, I'm glad we won this race in New York, but I hope the Democrats don't use it as uh, an excuse to do nothing. I hope the Democrats don't use it as an excuse to do nothing. Will the Democrats use that as an I excuse mean, to do nothing? I love this coming from Bill Clinton. <laughs> Bill Clinton in 1995, let's, do, let's roll the tape here. In 1995, Newt Gingrich actually succeeded in reducing Medicare. What does Bill Clinton do, whose who's, who's political fortunes were really low? That he demagogued Medicare. You go back and look at the ads that they ran. It was all about throwing granny in the snow. It worked. He got reelected president in 1996, and then what did he do? Nothing. He did not lift a finger to do anything about, and about look, entitlements. Obama, Obama has clearly made exactly the same decision that Clinton did in 95. He didn't speak about entitlements in the budget, which incidentally went to a, vo a vote in the Senate and was defeated 97 to zero this week, uh, to say what contempt even Democrats had for it. He is completely running on the following bet. Americans are against the debt in the abstract, but if you touch anything of the entitlements, you're going to lose. And thus, between now and at least until Election Day, Democrats will do absolutely nothing on entitlements except demagoguing.